Josephine Finn wanted to come up and give a few words? Oh, you did it? Oh, they asked you. They asked you. Alright. So, you, you gonna stay right there and go? Or, or, alright, alright, cool, cool. She gonna say some words. I, I, I was, I'm excited for this. Good evening, family. Good evening. Good evening, family. Good evening. How, how'd you like that show? Wow. So you've been talking about the dream tank and power. And so back in 2007, I started the dream tank. And I had no idea at that time what it would amount to. So the first lesson is, when you have an idea, something is laid on your heart, you should do it. Because look what it has turned into. 2007, I went to the Office of Court Administration. I said, I am tired of putting kids in jail with, without them ever even having had the chance to have a dream. And that's how the dream tank got started. Basically because I was too impatient to wait for them to take 10 years to give me permission. So I talked to a guy by the name of Robert Vernon, who's from Monticello, and he had a foundation. And he handed me a check to start the dream tank. And here we are 12 years later, because five years ago, I got another call from the universe. And I went to the New York State Board of Regents, and I represent the district all along the Hudson River, all the way up to Albany. And when they decided that they were going to do my Lord's Keeper, and the state gave them $20 million, I said, you're not taking all that money in New York City. I'm telling you that now. OK? You're going to remember the small town. I come from one. And I better see some of that money in Sullivan County. Is it here? It's here. It's here. By the way, another 20 million coming for next year. I bring you greetings from the Chancellor of the New York State Board of Regents, Betty Rosa. Uh, much love to her because she believes in our youth, and so do we. I want to give a, a special yell out to the superintendent of the Montessori Central School District, Tammy Mangus. <laughs> because when I called her and said, listen, this grant's coming out and I need you to write, she said, how soon? I said, now. <laughs> write it down. And she did. And here you see the results. So this is what you can do in your community if you believe. I want to just say one thing to our young people. You should understand just one thing about life. If I can tell you just one thing. Don't ever give up. Never give up. You're going to be tempted. Sometimes you get tired. But I'm here to tell you if you just keep going, you can make it. And the very morning you wake up and say you're going to get up, give it up. Guess what? That's the day that everything's going to turn for you. So remember that. That you are worthy. Do you see the talent you have? This is amazing. So I'm so happy that you parents and families come out to support our young people. Do you think we should do this again? If we don't capture the hearts and minds of our youth, someone else will. So let's stick with our kids and let's see them through to the end. Thank you so much. Give it up one more time for Jeff Josephine Finn. So I'm talking about it. Um, I can't believe I forgot to thank, I, I didn't even acknowledge Miss Tammy Mangus in the building. Give it up for her, man. Thank, thank you so much. Thank you. I love you. All right, um, 
Remember I had said that Eric Young couldn't be here, but this was always his dream. His son is actually here, Derek. So I would like to invite Derek up to say a few words. I believe that's what, yeah, here we go, here we go. Give it up for Derek one time. Stage real quick. Ah, boy, this kind of makes me kind of nervous, but yeah, I'm, I'm here, you know, because my dad couldn't be. Um, unfortunately, he's not feeling too well right now, but he is here in spirit for sure. Um, and hopefully next year. But like, I just want to piggyback off of what Miss Ping said. Um, and uh, you know, like, it's, it's really cool to see like the kids in Sullivan County actually have a place where they can go and, uh, you know, show their talents, you know, and because uh, we didn't have that. A lot of us didn't have that. And uh, I just, I'm just thankful for everything. Thankful for my father, you know, because a lot of people don't have fathers, you know, and a lot of people, you know, they feel like they don't have a talent, but don't ever feel like that. You know, whatever you dream about, whatever... Whatever dreams you have, you definitely can accomplish it. You know, everything you can. Um, you know, I just basically, that's all I wanted to say. And it's, uh, you know, my father's here. He keep us in your prayers. And uh, that's it. Thank you. All right? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. So, um, with that being said, I guess this is the time to... I don't know, hang out, maybe go buy some Mammy K t shirts, you know? But for all that, um, 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 Dream Tech! Dream Tech! Dream Tech! Dream Tech! Dream Tech! Thank you. Wow, we're not over. We're not done. We're not done. We got brutality in the building. How can I forget? So, uh, my, my, yeah, so, as last year's winners, we are so happy that they invited us back to play for you guys and the judges are deliberating. So we've got a short set for you guys. <laughs>
Second thank you to our sound guys back there who are the unsung heroes of the night. They're making everything sound clear, so give them a big round of applause. And last thing for the performers, all you guys sound killer. It's like, in my mind, it's a dead tie on first place, Erica. <laughs> Check us out via social media, Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, YouTube. It's usually Brotality Bands. You can check us out there. A like and a subscribe would really help. And we also just released a new EP about a month ago in March. And that's available on every streaming or album downloading platform anywhere. So we would a lot if you can check that out. We've got one more song for you guys. And I, I want you guys to chant with me on this one, so just follow my lead.
Judges are about ready to, um, well, no, 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 I already have the winners. I, they, they, they already decided. But, uh, um, first place, winner of $1,000. Start with third. No, 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 I'm not starting with first, oh. like, calling out. I'm just saying the names, I mean, the price, you feel me? Second place, $500. Third place, $250. That's a lot of money. That's, wow. All right. So, um. But why don't we call him out? Place is going to have an opportunity to perform here. I'm so glad you said somebody just somebody just told me to say that too, and I just forgot. All right. So let's start with third place. Y'all ready? Yeah. All right. The winner of third place is Jalil Jones and Naeem Warner from Monticello School District. Come get your money, family. This is exciting to me because they, they're in the so I'm excited. Here you go, brother. Congratulations. Congratulations. Give it up for these young men right here. Woo! Come on, here. I think I'm out of the picture. Take one, but make sure y'all get one just y'all for y'all mom, right? Okay.
I'm not surprised by this one. Vincent Benny Sticks Band Love! Come on, bro. Come on, brother. Oh, wow, he looks just like him. I thought that was you. Vincent Benny Sticks! Come on, man. You did it. You made it. Come get your money, man. You're bringing that money home. You're the big man tonight. <laughs> big man tonight. Stay in there if anybody want to take your picture. This is his candy. This young man is amazing. Give it up one more time, man. So deserving. So deserving. The judges wanted me to let y'all know that this was not an EG decision at all. And I believe it because I couldn't imagine being a judge. So kudos to y'all, man. Give it up for these judges right here, man. For judging this. All right. And yes, yes, yes. Very good point. Thank you to all the performers. Y'all all did an amazing job. And just like our brother from Brutality said, y'all all first place in my eyes. So give it up one more time for the whole show. Clock this winner is about to be rewarded with $1,000 cash and a performance here at Bethel Woods. So um, with all that being said, Great idea. Let's get all the performances on the stage right now. I was performing last year. I remember this part. This is exciting. Let's go round and look, man. I just want to say that this was like a, a, a really great, great show. Like, forget about it being a competition and for points and all that stuff. This was like an awesome, awesome, awesome show. And I'm so glad that so many people came out to support their friends and their family. These kids are amazing and these are our future. You know what I mean? And musically, they're amazing. Like, these kids, you want to see these performances and people bring tears to your eyes. And like these kids, they're in high school, they just go to school every day in, in the music program. And they came up here and they brought tears to our eyes. Like, these are some amazing, 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 amazing young people. I love all of y'all, man. Y'all are number one in my eyes. Are we ready to announce the winner? Yeah! yeah! All right, all right. I'll show y'all ready. Give it up for Sophia Chavisani. Would you like to see some Sophia? Can I say something? I think you 
you guys to say something. Hi. Hi. <laughs> um, thank you so much. Um, yeah, I don't really know what to say. Oh, thanks. I'm shaking. Thanks. <laughs> thanks. <laughs> Sullivan County Community Chorus website and buy yourself some tickets. Right. 